similar. I would say for companies that are already up and running, um, start where you have traction and experience already, you know, where you have clients and case studies that you can reference. So they know that you're not just fishing, you know? Um, so start with what, you know, works. And then from there, you could branch out and test um, other markets, but get your process and your messaging and your outreach down first to something that you know works. Um, and if you don't know what your best market is, get help. There are experts out there that can help you figure out what that is. Um, we offer go-to market um, workshops for our clients for that reason itself. And then um, I guess for lists where you would get it, I say outsource, whether it's through a database or hiring someone to manually do it for you. Um, if you're in sales or marketing or a CEO, that's probably not your specialty, you know, and you probably don't have the time for it anyways. You know, there are people out there that that's their job. Get them to do it. I can speak more on the go-to-market strategy, um, you know, for the people obviously that have companies that are up and running, get the small wins. You know, if you already have a clientele that's, for example, focused on 10 to 20 employees um, within South Florida, then keep going for more of those companies because whoever you're reaching out to will see that credibility um, as well. Um, so I would say that's for that. And obviously for the people that are still up and running, still trying to build up their clientele, uh, maybe like a new startup or company that's just brand new in general. Um, you know, again, like Ashley said, seeking help, right? There are people that are business development consultants that will help you, but a lot of it comes from actually doing testing um, on the ground, speaking to people, surveys, and actually figuring out the people that you think you're going for, do they actually see the value prop that you're preaching about? So that's what I would say from my perspective.